Assalamu alaikum my name is Dr Talha Shafiq and welcome to my YouTube channel in this short clip uh, we will going to discuss about the metacarpal bones of the dog actually this is our second video on the menace of dog uh, in the first video we have discussed about the carpal bones the link of this video is given in the description metacarpal bones are the long bones all five metacarpal bones are present in case of dog the numbering of these bones start from the medial to the lateral as we have talked about the distal row of the carpal bones the first one is much smaller as you can see that while the third and fourth are the largest one fifth metacarpal bone is the widest at the proximal end and uh, it is slightly shorter than the second metacarpal bone these bones have convex dorsal surface and concave palmar surface if you try to observe third and fourth metacarpal bones are basically four sided while second and uh, fifth are three sided that is the main identification now the question is how can you differentiate between third fourth and uh, uh, second and fifth metacarpal bone basically third and fourth metacarpal bones are four sided uh, while second and fifth metacarpal bones are three sided this is the main identification point to differentiate these bones i am repeating again that how can you differentiate between metacarpal bones first metacarpal bone is very easy to identify as it is shortest among all third and fourth metacarpal bones are the longest and uh, these are four sided while the second and fifth metacarpal bones are smaller than the third and fourth metacarpal bone and these bones are three sided uh, if you have to identify between second and fifth metacarpal bone then fifth metacarpal bone is slightly shorter than the second one and at the proximal end it is wider than the second metacarpal bone now if we look from the proximal side then you can see that proximally all these are close to each other but distally diverge somewhat proximally and form base that articulate with the corresponding carpal bones that we have discussed in the carpal bones distal end of all bones contain head but bear a sagittal ridge except the first metacarpal bone this sagittal ridge is present on the palmar side actually this ridge helps to articulate with the corresponding phalanx between base and head body is present the first metacarpal bone is atypical it's a vestigial structure present in dog That's all about the metacarpal bones please like the video and subscribe our channel to encourage us that's all stay blessed allah hafiz